Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome back to One Shot, maybe. Let's see what happens when it loads. Actually, you beat the game. Never mind. Okay, it looks like it worked this time. What you have to do is after you've beaten the game, you'll find a quote-unquote save file in the um, My Games under the documents of your computer. Delete that. Hello? Eric? Wait, why did I say that word? Eric? Why does it sound so familiar? Password in documents. One second. Okay, I'm not sure what that means yet. I didn't find anything new in my documents. Okay, it looks like it worked. It looks like you were able to remove the restriction. In that case, you were ready to continue. The necessary preparations are already in place. This session might run a very different on a very different course depending on your actions. If you can recognize my symbol, you know, should know what to do. Ha, <laughs> look at me. Asking you for favors only to become so apprehensive once you agreed. I understand if you wish to, to leave some questions unanswered. I understand if you do not believe in a happy resolution. If you enjoy the world as it is, if you are satisfied with the story as it is, if you really do not want Oh, I see. I see anything change for the better or for worse, then pretend you never saw this. Carry on the session as you normally would. Do not use my journal for anything other than what you were already familiar with. This option will always remain for you, though. That's why I implore you to consider Josiah, the world, my children. They all deserve a good ending. Let's check it again. Okay, S. Oh, I didn't re read the whole thing. S O. Uh, this will be risky. Probably that the entity's condition will worsen is quite high. If that happens, then. Then. S-O. S-O-L-S. You're simply afraid of what- I understand if you are simply afraid of what may happen, because I'm afraid too. S-O-L-S. S-O-L-S. S-L-O-L-S. S-L-O-L-S. Let's see if we can start putting this stuff in now. S. Wait. S.
little stick. Lost it up somewhere. Try this again. S O. I apologize for mess for all this messing around. L S Pretty sure this is exactly what I just spelled. Oh. Let's start over. Didn't realize I can change the, the uh, case of them. S. Oh, okay, those are. Definitely uppercase. L. Does that look lowercase or uppercase to you? I suppose it's lowercase since it's in cursive. So Lowercase t, lowercase i. Case e. Uh, I'm not entirely certain. Damn it! All right, hang on. I didn't notice the E. It's solstice, not solstice. Solstic. Hi again. How are you? You found me. Why? You're already too late. Not much of the world remains. This will be apparent once you go outside. This place was never worth saving. You still want to try? And remember this. Your actions here will affect Nico. Your mission is to help Nico leave. And most importantly... No. This does not feel right at all. Have we been through this already, Eric? But that should be impossible. You only had one shot. I wasn't supposed to exist after that. Nico hears the sound of the door unlocking. Eric? Sounds so familiar. Dusty books. It's too dark to read in here. Eric 
pair of luminous yellow eyes stare back at Nico. Withered plants here stick and dry, a branch snaps off. Tub won't run. You just woke up here. A glow trickle of lights trickles through the window. Hello? Anyone? TV gives off a dangerous looking spark. Wood in the fireplace looks like it was never used. Perhaps it could be lit. Sink won't turn on. Inside the refrigerator is a bottle of alcohol. Nico takes it. Nico dips the branch in the alcohol. Nico readies the branch. Ah! Something on the ground glimmers in the firelight. It appears to be a small metallic object which in a crack in the floor. Nico digs it out. Bulb. Wasn't on the first time I got here. There we go. Come, little Messiah, there's work to do. Computer terminal. Robot no longer has power. Good talk to the prophecy robot. Ah! That light bulb, you are here. Uh, me? Yes! Welcome to our world, friend. I am most humbled by your presence, yes. Um, thanks. Sorry, I'm a little lost. Ah, right, allow me to explain some things. May I first ask you how you arrived here? I'm not sure. I woke up in this weird house. It's really dark. Oh, so you woke up in an unfamiliar dark location. Mm-hmm. Just as my prophecy foretold. Yes. You are the savior we have been waiting for. You will be the one to save our world from eternal darkness. Um, I'll now provide you with vital information. Please ask me anything. Uh, well, can you tell me about... Me. When I woke up in that house, for some reason I called out a name. Eric. I'm not sure why I did that. Then I saw it on the computer too. Ah, that would be our god. Oh, right. I, I think I, I feel like I remember something about that. You do? Uh, wait, did you not just arrive here? I was the one who was supposed to inform you of that. So how did you know? I, hmm, it just made sense, I guess. Ah, have you already con contacted Eric then? Nope, I just have to close my eyes and focus, right?
Hey, Eric. God. It's gonna sound weird, but have we met before? Yes. Ah! But I don't know who you are, though. It's just a weird feeling that I have. Oh, I better just being silly, aren't I? Sorry. But it's nice to meet you, Eric. My name is Nico. Just contact your Eric. Yeah. Do not be afraid to act, ask Eric for assistance. You are the Messiah, after all. Can tell me about this world. Where I am exactly. I can't see too far off. Everything's so dark. Our world is not always this dim. Nor was it so broken. But time waits for nobody, not even saviors. This world is divided into three regions. You're on the fringe right now, the barrens. That tower you see in the distance once held our sun. Oh, so that's what that tall thing is. As you go further towards the center, you will cross the other regions. There should be a map still in this outpost somewhere. Ooh, can you tell me about... It's light bulb. Not in the house when I woke up in. In your hands is our new son. Your son? Yes. Years ago, our previous son sat atop that tower and spilled its life onto the land. One day, the light went out. Oh. The world is still hanging on by a thread. The surface of this world is abundant with an element called phosphor. Fortunately for us, this element stored light energy from our previous sun. It's now our only source of illumination, but its energy is finite. When the last of the light dies, our world will too. Uh, but now that you are here with the new sun, all is well. You will need to restore it to the tower. It looks pretty far off. Yes, so it begins your pilgrimage. Also, the sun is fragile. Be careful. The sun shatters. The world will end in an instant. Oh, can you tell me about going home? Oh, I don't mean to be rude, but I... I'm not sure about this. I still don't know how I got here. I was just with my mom a few hours ago, and now it feels like I'm in a bad dream. I just want to go home. Your mission is to save our world, just as my mission is to tell you about our world. I am unable to help you beyond my programming. I am sorry. Oh. I think that's all I have to ask for now. Excellent. I wish you luck. Won't turn on. Dusty shells. Robot seems to be okay, just doesn't have power. Battery, yada yada yada. Some of this are, we already know, so I'm just going to skim through it. Like these. Seeds on Earth. Seeds on Earth and Axe. Shelves. Poster. During the Foster Shrimp spawn period, survey pond with bubble over surface. Please contact management immediately. We'll pass your harvest team ASAP. I 
think I'm heading the wrong way. I think the bar's up here, but I could be wrong. It's been a little bit. Hopefully this author guy knows what he's talking about. I see a green glow in the distance. Uh, hello? Eric, are you there? Yep. Good. It's over here attached to a boat. He doesn't have any power, and his joints are all rusted over as well. I think we should be able to fix it. Well, we need to cross this ocean to get to the tower. Right about that, kiddo. Ah. Light. It's broken off from one of those terminals. We will not be using that just yet. This might lead to the gas. It does. Eric, there's nothing in the air here. It hurts to breathe. Oh, just apologies, dear boy. I need to fast travel more. Save time. Cross the pipe in here, oh, but I don't want to get too close. It's scary. You're not my boy. open it. A little metal cube and some broken glass in here. Looks like what used to be a machine part. It says solar battery on the side. Hmm. Forget where we get the lens. Use the bed until Nico tells us it's time to eat that he's tired. Hmm. I'll see if it's locked with a six digit code. I don't remember seeing any six digit codes, do you, Eric? Might work. Let's try it. That's the problem. What if I need to delete that document? Will 
will just update itself. Strange black plants that look like clovers. Hi, the light bulb. So are you the Messiah? So I've been told. I expected someone taller. Someone who doesn't look like a kid. So you're alright, some sort of cat? Uh huh, I'm a person. You got the eyes of a cat. Cats walk on four legs. Well, either way. I feel like you being the Messiah just doesn't feel right. The robot back there says there's no mistake. I know. It's gonna sound cold, but. I honestly think you're better off just leaving and letting the world die naturally. The world's been falling apart for a long time. In matter of decay, it's highly improbable that the sun can fix it. You've already seen how bad it can get, right? You haven't seen much of anything, actually. You can't really just leave. Honestly, you just got here. Then you must be heading towards the tower. Mm-hmm. You aren't supposed to put the light bulb, or the sun, isn't it? Yes, at the very top. You know, the tower contains a force that nobody could comprehend. The power is the strongest of the sun. Maybe it'll send you home after you complete your mission. Oh, don't take me a word for it, though. What's inside the tower? I don't know. Nobody's ever entered it before. At least, nobody in history knows. Then, who built it? Built? As far as anyone can tell, it's been there since the beginning of time. I know someone who wanted to study it before, but... Oh? He never told me if it went anywhere. Silver, heard about the mines... Shelf. Ah, it's a screwdriver. You can take it if you want. It may help you. Oh, are you sure? Yes, I have many. Thank you. Well, just a table covered in dust. I haven't played chess today for a long time. Oh? Not even with the other robots? No. Nobody in the Barons has the capacity in their programming. But here is tamed, for that matter. Freight? Full of growing shrimp, the top's covered with a wire mesh. Please don't touch that. Oh, sorry, I got curious. What is this thing? Backup power cell. Keeps me functional. The main generator for the Barons ran out of power some time ago. It not even last a week without the sun. It's already here that. All we can do is make use of the light we have. Wait. So you headed towards this direction. The mines have been abandoned for a long time. I cannot guarantee that it's safe. You must enter. It is my duty to accompany you at least once. Oh, thanks. There's a little gadget on the ground. It's like a camera. What's left of a camera, anyway? Probably even part of a robot at one point. Oh. Or not. I don't know. Check the screwdriver. Can we screwdriver to pull out the lens? Okay. Done. Now we take the lens, put it in the battery, and it's popped right in. Battery, power the light bulb, screwdriver in the battery. I never would have thought of that. Good thinking, Eric. Now it looks like it's already pretty charged. That was fast. Do be careful in here. What's that? You okay? You were staring, turning the black out. I saw something? It was like a really short dream just now. Oh? Something like a robot with a yellow eye. That's strange. You sure you're okay? Yeah. You know, now that you've mentioned it, there's a robot who always insisted on going back to the abandoned mines. But how long the mines have been in disrepair. 
It doesn't look broken or anything. I didn't really see him, see him, do you know? Like I said, it was kind of like a dream. It was so close. It's like a kind of a visual glitch or hallucination. Whatever it is that living beings have. Hmm. Is this that robot you know of have a yellow eye? I don't think I've seen any of the robots like that. I would not know. I never read it myself. Only heard of them from a friend of mine. Friend, huh? Hold on, something's in my pocket. It's, that wasn't glowing before. What is this? That was going to be my question. Where did you get that book? Oh, uh, it was with me when I woke up back at the house. I didn't really question it at the time. I flipped through a couple of pages, but I couldn't understand a word. Is that just something Messiahs are supposed to wake up with? No, I never heard of anything like that. But I know who wrote the book. Oh? However, I've only seen his books with a black clover on the cover. I went through the trouble of putting a yellow phosphor in it. In fact, he woke up with it in the first place. It really has me intrigued. Yellow phosphor? Oh yeah, that's the rear... Phosphor that people think the sun is made of, right? Wait a minute, how do I know this? I don't think anyone's told me about it. Ah, I can show you if you like. My friend gave me this a long time ago. Pretty. Oh, looks like there's a clover in the necklace, too. Like the book. Well, it is the same person. Oh. That's why I think this journal would be important. You said it just started glowing? Yeah? It was right after your vision, then. This has to mean something. Maybe you should at least try to read it again. Okay. drawing of this room. So I guess we should come here? Which we did already. Looks like we're on the right track. Literally. Charge battery does something. Whoa. It's alive! Alive! I am functional. Did you power the generator? I guess we did, right, Eric? Hi again, you prick. So you've made progress in this world, Eric. But that progress stops here. I believe you need a code to unlock a certain box. Well, the code no longer exists in this world. Do you understand what that means, Eric? Yes. Good. Start looking. code you need is... Yeah, I see. Let me show you. The code you need 
is 157047. Going straight into the point this time. You just look around here better anyway. I miss notes and such. This one. seeing one. I had some help. Really? From who? Eh, uh, don't worry about it. Okay. What's in the safe, Nico? Alright, let's see. Ah! I found a gas mask. Anything else? Okay. Uh-oh. What is that? You should, kiddo. They're rubber gloves. They're a bit heavy. Be a Pedro Dado book. Do the important clean sun and the recipe. Set of gas, blue phosphor, rare form. Instructions. Here, direct the gas to the of choice. Seal immediately. Hello, person. The robot assembly and repair service have been discontinued at the Barrens. If further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. It's all bolted up. Forcing loose, though. I should be able to pull it off with the right tool. I think I got the scrubber. What a workout. Maybe a page ripped out of a book. Okay, without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Shake vigorously to initiate the reaction. Use as soon as possible. Note, if elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Also note, hand protection is critical after this step. The resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. I don't know what half these words mean. Good thing you're here, Eric. Meaning spun with a rough surface. Hello, person. Welcome to the old chemical processing plant. The equipment has already been relocated. Blanking on what the syringe is. Something weird about robots who were getting near since of the gas, you know, they appear to accumulate the rest of the much slower race than others. Few who work directly with the gas harvesting look practically new. Is that the result of the atmosphere or am I just seeing things? Well, it seems to be the result of the acidic quality of the acid, the, at, at the gas, rather. I'm sure prolonged exposure to the gas is probably not going to be good for their coat. I say it like it's, like, a, like it's a paint job. You know, it's gonna start corroding the metal. And that's no good. Hello there. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? 
living person of Giselle should have been evacuated. Should have evacuated this place long ago. Oh, but I just got here. This world, I mean. See? I had the sun. Oh, the Messiah. I do not know what to say. Greeting you was not part of my programming. Have you spoken to the Prophet, Bob? I think so, yeah. The robot was built with the sole purpose of greeting you. Really? As he cannot speak with anyone else. At least, not with ease. Oh, that's kind of sad. What are you built for, then? My purpose is to guard this settlement. Even though the residents have long gone, I must remain. Ah. Why, though? I have not been tamed. Tamed? It was not worth the effort. Anything you need help with, or... I don't remember. By the way, some of the robots may start following you around the settlement as well. Do not be alarmed. It is your job to keep people safe. So I think there's writing on this one too. This is Guardian of Residential Area. Trip things. Still afraid of ladders, Nico? Scared of ladders. Unit RM2883417, reporting for duty. So you spoke with the guardian of the settlement. I will now escort you to the, to you reach the dormitory. Um, what? That didn't happen before, but I don't think it means anything. Which dormitory are we talking about? Being taught in school, have a lot of surrounding, yada yada yada. Need to find the needle. Ha! Little person of organic makeup, welcome to the infirmary. Scanning for injuries. Um, scan complete. Injuries detected none. Treatment required none. You are good to go. Uh, thanks? Box medical tools. Some are broken and rusted beyond use, but... This plastic strange seems to be okay. Hello, person. Are you seeking admission to the infirmary? No? Oh. Carry on, then. Hello, again, person who's alive. The infirmary is up ahead. so many robots, Eric. Or any robots at all. I've mean, seen them in cartoons and stuff, I've never seen one in person. Pretty neat, don't you think? Yeah. I'm not gonna tell him to do a robot voice. Can't make me. You have no power here. I'm thinking this page is faded. Checking, checking. Terminal does not respond. This is a problem. All the terminals do not boot. I'm not sure what to do now. I was in here already, wasn't I? Yes. Just here. Yeah, my memory's worse than usual. I'm a little preoccupied. Duty, since you already left. Would you like me to leave? Not only if you want, understood. And now squirt you till you reach your dormitory. I don't have a dormitory, mate. Didn't press that.
Mental drawing. Yeah, don't show me it or anything. So whatever we do, we can't leave without doing the, uh, whatever we need to do with that minecart. It's on the ground. All the others are taller than me. Fill the bottle with the ass, Eric? I don't know how to do it. This pond is very different. The water looks like jelly. I want to sort of bubble over the surface of the pond. So we're filling out the syringe here? Yeah, this is kind of like a funnel. I think it might be a little too thick to fit in the needle. Nah, it'll be fine. Hey, it actually went in. Gross. The sky is dark. Yeah, it is. Do you know this when the sun will be back up? We're working on it. Functional. Was it you who fixed the generator? Well, Eric helped me. But yeah. Hello, nice to meet you. I am robot number 310. So I'm going to take you somewhere. Are you okay? I cannot move. You're still pretty rusty. That is true. Come on, Eric and I will find a way to help you. choice. There. How's that? I can move again. Thank you. I'm able to fill my purpose again. Where would you like to go? Can you take me to the tower? Calculating. Closest destination to the tower is the Glen. Port number. My built-in navigation circuit is fried. I'm guessing I'm going to assume that's not good. It is not good at all. Once again, I cannot follow my programming. Aw. Is anything to do to help? In the event of an error, you should speak with the head engineer. She will know what to do. Hey, excuse me again, miss. I found a robot who can take me towards the tower. I was having some trouble, so it told me to talk to you. All right. What is the issue? Is it something about its navigation circuits being fried? Just the navigation circuits? Apparently. We're gonna fix everything else, I think. Here's something that may help. Robots have the ability to trace material from their source location. If the robot bar this, then it should, and its backup tracking system should activate. That's very pretty necklace. It's a made of amber fell from the blend. Something inside the amber. Black clover? That's a common plant in our world. 
It is also... I'm not sure I can bear to part with this. Bergen says yes, but I still feel conflicted. Never mind. To finish your mission more than I need a keepsake. Here. Oh, thank you. Before I go, is there anything I can do with in return? Actually, do you know how to play chess? Yeah, well, sort of. I played with some older kids before. Now, will you play a game with me? I mean, I don't know the rules very well, but I guess it's the least I can do. I'm really good at this. Thank you. It was built, it was built into my code. Ah, so what's it like being a robot and all? I've talked to other robots. They all say something about programming, code, and stuff. Even you do this now. It's a little hard to understand sometimes. I know. Most of the robots here are not tamed. Tamed? Watch out. There's my bishop. Taming is complicated. Oh, how complicated exactly? That's my other bishop. I can't really explain what tamed robots are, but I'm one of them. All the other tamed robots have been moved to other regions. Exactly where, I don't know. Oh? Here's my little horse. Night. Right. Oh, have you ever been to the other regions? I heard there's two more. In the past, yes. I still have the date, the coordinates, the memories. I don't know how much of that still holds true. Or maybe it would be a very different place now. Because the sun is gone? No. I said this already, didn't I? The sun probably won't save the world. Gangs start back before the sun went out. Sun's sudden death was just the tipping point, and things went south really fast after that. Oh, then there's nothing I can do? Check. What? When did your queen get there? The only thing you can do is complete your pilgrimage. In a way, you're only supposed to be a second chance for the people. Just like how the Barons was only to be, supposed to be a second chance to, for me. There's no guarantee that things will work out. But, checkmate. Alright, guess I've kept you long enough. Thank you for listening. I hope you get home safe. Ah, thank you also. Oh, I just realized I might have ballsed it up. Might have needed the uh, phosphor that was still inside the. Uh... Mm. Well, I need to call it a video here anyway. I'm the Blue Sturdy Two. This is one shot. TTFN, I'll have for now.